Hey guys, so today we are doing a boho inspired look. I was inspired by my earrings. I just thought they were so pretty. So I wanted to do like a gold that was just like my earrings on my lid. So I'm using a uh, L'Oreal infallible paint on my lids. It's so pretty, it's so pretty. Um, and I just wanted that to be like the focal point of the look. So I just kind of put a little bit in my crease, um, a little bit brown in my crease and then just kind of called it a day with the eyes. When I do an eye without any liner, I think it's really important to curl your lashes and um, put mascara on just because you don't want to see the gap between your lid and or you don't want your lashes underneath your false lashes to be powdery. So really just get in there with some mascara and darken the lash line up. After I'm done priming my face, I'm gonna go in and go with some color corrector under my eyes and fix my dark circles. Now I'm going in with the Benefit Play Sticks foundation. I really like this foundation. It reminds me of the Hourglass Vanishing foundation, but the Hourglass one is a little bit more smooth. I just, I like stick foundations like this, but you gotta be careful if you do have dry skin, just be aware that you should moisturize first. Now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna contour my face. I recently have just started to cream and contour again. I notice a difference. I feel like my face is a little bit more round after pregnancy just because I haven't lost almost all the weight. So it really helps with the slimming effect of the face. But I, I prefer to cream contour than to powder contour. Now I'm going in with Tarte Shape Tape and I'm going to conceal my under eye circles and the orange concealer that was under there.
Now I'm going in with a powder to set my face. It's a powder that has some color into it, which is nice. So it adds a little bit more coverage. And now I'm going and bronzing my face and I'm gonna put some blush on. Now we're going in with my favorite highlight. This is the Ofra Nikki Tutorials highlight and the Everglow highlight. It's so beautiful. I feel like it's like the most blinding highlight that I have right now. <laughs> Also, now I'm going in with the Ofra Liquid Lipstick in Manila. I really like this color. It, they just came out with it, and I think it's like the perfect nude for my skin tone. It's not too peachy, which I hate because I feel like a lot of nudes have a lot of peaches, peach color tones in it, and I'm not all about that, but I really like this one. There's no peach in it. It's more of like a brown tan. It's really pretty. There is the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry it had to be a voiceover again. Just when I filmed during the day, Olivia is up with me and she's right next to me. So I don't want her making too much noise in the video. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, I'll see you later.